is officially here. Battlefield 6. And with it, the CPU usage is pretty high. Right now I'm in the menu, you can see it's in the mid 30s. Let's go to multiplayer. I'm gonna show you how to fix this on your system too. This high CPU usage. So they haven't done anything to fix it and it's been on all the Battlefield games. Now I'm running a 9800X3D just for reference. So I, you know, I shouldn't really have trouble, but the CPU is just, just way too high. So we'll try to do this all in one video. I can't play because my wrist is broken, but I can at least try to show this. Attack now. So look at the CPU objective. usage in the upper right. Up. Let's go. It's very high. It's like you know, 70, 75. I'd say we're averaging around 70 at this point. It's even hitting up into the 80s. At the lowest, we're getting maybe mid 50s. It's okay. But I got to go back towards uh, where is anything happening or this way. And it's much, much higher. So let's quit this and I'll show you how to fix it. Ow. Okay, so you need to open Notepad and then you'll have these five lines and I will put these in the description. So no worries. But what's important is the values here for me. It's 8, 8, and 16. And I got those by going to my task manager and going to the CPU and seeing the cores and logical processors. Now, whatever your cores are here is what you put in the first line. Logical processors here is when you put in the last two lines. You can see. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, you put this in the first two lines. You put this in the last one line. 8, 8, and 16. So if yours says 10 and 20, you would do 10, 10, and 20. So it's 8, 8, and 16 for me. And then what you need to do is save this. Go to save as. I'm already there. So you go to where your Steam files are. Steam library. Steam apps. Common. Battlefield 6. Change this to all files and save it as user.cfg. Save. That's all you need to do. Then close out of that, close out of that, and let's relaunch the game and see if we have any difference. So the average was about 60. It was pretty high. We were getting into the 70s, 80s. We'll see if it's any better now. This worked on the beta. It's worked on Battlefield 2042. So let's see if we have any luck on the official Battlefield 6 release. If it'll load, <laughs> there we go. Now it'll put us into a queue. With all luck now. Please, I hope everybody's enjoying the game. I won't be able to play for a little while until after I'm healed. And if this does help you, please consider doing a like. That would help me a lot. I'm a little baby channel because this should help again with your high CPU usage. It's going to, if you're seeing stutters, seeing weird issues in the game, this will just help a lot. So one thing to note is in the menu, we're now dipping down into the twenties, which we weren't doing before. It was well above 30 the whole time. Let's go to multiplayer. 
conquest and see if we have any improvement. didn't give us the same map unfortunately this is the one that looks like a it almost looks like an upside down Wu-Tang Clan symbol they just need a cut out at uh what I guess would be the top of the map why isn't anything loading okay see if they cut out this that would be more like a Wu-Tang Clan symbol. Ah, let me out. <laughs> so look, we're dipping down in the 40s, 30s, 30% 30 usage. Whereas before it was 70, higher. Look towards the, oh my God. I can't, I can't maneuver well. I'm literally, literally injured. Aircraft fueled and ready. Pilots are clear to engage. But it's pretty clear that the CPU usage is a lot better. So try this out in your game. Let me know in the comments if it helps you. Can we? He's already dead. And uh, again, please consider doing a like and subscribe if it has helped. Couple, couple little clicks would help me a lot. And I hope this makes your enjoyment of the game even better. I can't aim. All right. Good luck. Bye.